Kentucky bill that would allow courts to seize guns from people in crisis was filed today. Senate Bill 13, as it's now called, will likely face an uphill battle. Wave News reporter Sean Bowdy was in Frankfurt with the bill sponsors. The Crisis Aversion and Rights Retention Act, now Senate Bill 13, has been filed. It would allow law enforcement to petition the courts to remove firearms from someone in crisis. If someone you know is undergoing a mental crisis, you would go to police. Only police can go to the courts. It's a bill supporters say would prevent gun deaths, about half of which in Kentucky are suicides. It doesn't matter where it goes. It'll be a sign. And then that's where we focus our attention. Republican Whitney Westerfield co-sponsors the bill with Democrat David Yates. Similar bills have been proposed in Kentucky and fell short. Opponents say it infringes on Second Amendment rights and the presumption of innocence. Westerfield says more people will back it than will admit out loud. Obviously, we got a lot of opposition raised during that committee meeting, but I've also gotten uh, votes of support. There are members of both chambers who have reached out and said, I'm a yes vote. They're afraid to say that publicly. Um, but they are supportive. The bipartisan bill is likely to have strong support from Democrats. Would Senate President Pro Tem David Givens, a member of Republican leadership, there, was in the room line. with an open ear. And every time we can create space for conversations and cause colleagues to at least approach a piece of legislation with an open mind, I think we're all better for it as citizens. The full bill is online on the story at wave3.com. In Frankfurt, Sean Bowdy, Wave News.